Welcome to MonroeMotors.com. Today we have a 2014 Jeep Wrangler Unlimited Sahara Edition. This one is presented in amped orange pearl coat. It's got the black interior with the black removable roof. We'll start at the rear of the vehicle here. We'll start in the trunk bay. You can see the carpet is nice and clean. It's got the Jeep uh, authentic carpet. Nice and clean back here. Pretty roomy. You can pick, put quite a bit of stuff. It's got the padded roll bar back here. There's a light built in here. We have the Alpine uh, stereo system. So you got a, a subwoofer, I believe, in the rear. A 12 volt socket here. And underneath here, there's a another spare compartment. Okay, I'll go ahead and close the uh, rear here. Uh, it's got rear window defogger and a rear windshield wiper close the door here we got the rear tire on the tire carrier gives it that keeps that Jeep look it's got the uh, Jeep style tail lights we have a tow hook on the back it has Magnaflow exhaust with dual tips it's got the trailer hitch package on it and this tire here it looks like it's brand new it feels well new to the vehicle brand new um, from the factory uh, but it was never used on the road that's pretty cool and coming to the uh, rear wheel here we have the 18 inch wheels uh, Bridgestone uh, Duelers ATs uh, they are 18 inch uh, polished aluminum um, they do have a little bit of corrosion around here on every one of the the wheels I just want to point that out so I'll show you the front wheel and again there's that little bit of corrosion there just kind of what happens to polished aluminum over winters okay you can see it's got a, a light window tint in the back at the top here's your uh, passenger door nice clean I like that uh, kind of a brushed look with the uh, the bolts there gives it that more rugged look here's your uh, rear seat so cloth seats in this car uh, in black it's got the stitching on the seat kind of gives it a little more flare up on the roll bar we have some speakers up there so that's pretty cool and you got your light up there as well it's got a full console here so you got cup holders right back here for the passengers we have weather tech floor mats in the front and rear Close that door. Then we'll go to the passenger side. It's the floor, WeatherTech floor mats. Uh, I think this is really cool. The Jeep with the since 1941 when they started. Nice vents here. I'll show you the uh, seat here. So I scan the seat. Good looking seat. Uh, the Sahara there that is embroidered in the seat. Part of the package. Let's close this. I'll just show you here. This is a three piece top. You can see the condition up there. There's your seam there. It splits in between up front so you can take the top off. Pretty cool. Here's your chrome mirrors. It's got uh, chrome door handles. A lot of chrome on this Jeep. Here's your hinges. It's got side steps. I do want to point out there is a little bit of bubbling in this hinge here very common on these Jeeps uh, here we got Sahara Unlimited Wrangler windshield looks good one thing really unique about the Jeeps is there's all kinds of hidden things in this you see the windshield there that's the Jeep grill that's in the windshield you'll see that all throughout uh, we got color matched mud flaps all the way around we have the color colored match uh, fender flares in the front it's got the chrome hinges for the hood straps, uh, bumper here, uh, it's the factory plastic. It's a little discolored from being in the sun. The silver looks good. It's got a the aux bar uh, for pulling behind an RV. You can see that's a nice condition there. And we've got the tow hooks up here. It's got fog lights down here. And it's got the chrome surrounds around the headlights and the lights and the grill pieces and the chrome Jeep. 
under the hood nice and clean it's got the uh hood liner underneath the hood here it's got the jeep uh, v6 in it it's a 3.6 liter pentastar motor uh produces 285 horsepower this is also an automatic jeep so it's a it's got the five speed automatic transmission in it come on, let's see if i can close it this up here for you guys all right let's take a look at the paint the paint is really shiny on this vehicle now there is a little bit of flaws there's a little scratch there there's a the little things you can point out the fenders do have some stone debris uh, in the grill here there's a touch-up spot of paint there's more uh, stone chips in the fender here but overall a, a really nice Jeep here's your other wheel again with the uh, corrosion there I guess one nice thing they all match and there you are there and we'll come to the passenger rear here still got that that same cool look Nice and clean. The seats are nice and clean. Close that. Driver door. That cool piece there. It's got power door locks. Door release here. And these doors all do come off. You just disconnect this and lift, they lift right off the hinge. So really cool little Jeep. Uh, we have the uh, vents here. Over here you have your headlight controls. On the steering wheel you got voice command and your arrow keys for the dash. And then we have your cruise control settings over here and then your windshield wipers here. It does have a tilt. It's a manual tilt on this one. So there's your tilt. And then here's your gauges. Uh, 56,525 kilometers on this, on this Jeep. So very clean. Let's start it up. Low kilometers for a this year okay we got visors with the mirrors there's your separation for your your top here so these two pieces will come out and you can take the whole thing off if you'd like scrolling down here we have a nice little pocket down here and then we have the serious uh touch screen here it's, i think it's a six and a half inch touch screen you got your voice command your radio features over here um and we do have uh, navigation so I'll just hit that there and just show you uh, go back let's go back here well it does have navigation <laughs> uh, AM FM stereo uh, here's your power windows so they're all in the center here so that controls all the windows here we got two vents over here and they say Jeep uh, below here we have your temperature controls um, Here's your power mirror, and then we have heated seats for driver and passenger, your traction control, your hill assist, uh, 12 volt socket, and we have a t um, 12 volt uh, socket there as well. So this is a, a socket for your... And then down here we have your four wheel drive controls. So it has two high, four high, neutral, and four low. And then here's your automatic transmission right here. Your e-brake down here. We have cup holders for driver passenger. Here's your, your console. Let's open this up here. So nice deep console. It goes pretty darn, darn deep down there. Uh, 12 volts here. And then you have uh, a little light here with USB. And then we have also have a little contray here. So if you want to put stuff here inside there, pretty neat. Got the light sensitive mirror as well, I should point out. Okay, let's open the door up. Uh, give it a couple revs for you. There we go. Sounds okay for uh, not being a sports car. All right, let's uh, close the doors here. Move to the front of the vehicle. I got the lights on. It runs good. 
nice and quiet, not noisy. Again, look at the shine in this thing. Beautiful. Here's your steps, your trail rated badge over here. Four-door model is nice because he's got the longer wheelbase, gives you a nice ride. We got a nice Jeep uh, gas cap over here, and chrome. We'll come to the rear of the vehicle here. Yeah, this is a nice little Jeep. This uh, you can drive around this, daily drive it, and, or pull it behind an RV. Anyways, this is a 2014 Jeep Wrangler Sahara Unlimited four-wheel drive in amped orange and black interior. This is uh, here and available at MonroeMotors.com. Come down and have a look at this one for yourself. We look forward to seeing you real soon.